Hey everybody, it's Chef James here at the RMHC Kentucky in a Commercial Kitchen in Louisville, Kentucky. We are going to make a quick grab and go item for some of our families that are staying with us here at the house. We're gonna be making some grab and go egg bites. Uh, it's a perfect high protein snack to have around the house. It's great for picky kids and busy schedules. If you're a person that likes a meal prep or you're looking to get into it, this is a great way to start. So stay around after the video. We are gonna have a special announcement from the Kentucky Anna House to you. So we have eggs, we have whole milk, small curd, cottage cheese. We have shredded cheddar. I highly recommend that you shred your cheddar for this recipe and not use the stuff that's in the packages just because as easy as it is, that extra starch that they use to keep it from caking really does, you know, kind of mess with your recipe a little bit. So shred your cheddar. Plus you get to control it. Tastes good. So we have some baking mix. This can be pancake mix. Any brand will work. If you want even more protein in this recipe, you could even use uh, like a higher protein pancake mix, something like that. Salt, pepper, and then a little bit of sweetener. So that can be really anything. It can be maple syrup. We're gonna use a little bit of honey. So what we wanna do is we're gonna take our eggs, add it to our bowl, and then we're just gonna give them a little beat up. So just break those yolks. Doesn't have to be perfect because we're gonna be mixing some other items in there as well. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna add our cottage cheese and our cheddar all at the same time. Yeah. A Little bit of salt and pepper, just a sprinkle and just a splash of our honey. So we're gonna mix that really, really well. We wanna make sure all of that shredded cheddar is kind of separated out that we don't get any big pockets. Now, if you want to adjust this recipe, add some sausage, bacon maybe, some bell pepper, any of those things are gonna work. Just if you have vegetables, just give them a little bit of a cook. You know, just throw them on the stove, toss them around a little bit in a pan. Okay, so our egg and cheese mixture is all together. And then with your baking mix, we just want to kind of sift it, make sure that we don't have any lumps. And then we're gonna slowly add this while stirring kind of the whole time. We just don't want any clumps in this, which I know is kind of counter counterintuitive with pancake mix, right? You always wanna leave a little bit of clumps, but this, not so much. This is looking good. Go ahead and make sure your oven is preheated at 375 and then we're going to go ahead and put our liners into our muffin pan. So we're going to pop these in the oven and it's going to go for about 20, 25 minutes, depending on, you know, your oven. Start at 20 minutes. Here we go. All right, so we're out of the oven. We let these cool off a little bit. Now, at this point, if you're gonna be using them for like meal preps in the future, pull them out of here, put them on a sheet tray or, you know, just a, a like a cookie sheet, put them in your freezer and let them, you know, let them kind of cool down in there and freeze. And then you can put them into a gallon Ziploc bag, have them ready to go. Just pull them out the night before, let them thaw in the fridge overnight. And then you can heat them up in the microwave if you want, or if they're ready to eat, you can eat them right there. So. We got these and we are just going to go and take the little bit of parchment paper off here and I'm going to package all these up so that the families have something they can just grab and go, take it to the hospital with them if they need to. So about that announcement that I said we had, so we are going to be adding an additional option to volunteer here in the Love Serve Daily program. So we are adding a healthy snack time. So we can, you can make kind of anything that you really want. We do have some options available to pick from on our website, such as these egg bites. We have that recipe on there. Just another way you can volunteer your time here at the house and really just help the families get the nutrition they need to get through their day. I'm Chef James. Thank you so much for joining us today for another episode of Season with Love here at Ronald McDonald House Charities of Kentuckiana.